So we're going to do some prep for this. Um, I mean, all right, so let me get some context here. So there's this new tournament that's coming up. We finally have online events for Scarlet and Violet, which was functionality that still had to be added into the game that we just got. Uh, and this tournament's called the Paldea Prologue. Now, what the Paldea Prologue is, is it's an online tournament. You have a team. Um, are they? Yeah, they're auto leveled to 50. Good. I was going to say that'd be weird if it wasn't. Uh, and you're restricted to using Pokemon found in the Paldea decks. That means no Charizard, no Quagsire, uh, you know, the, the usual thing. But you're allowed to use one restricted Pokemon, being either Coridon or Miraidon. So, yeah, uh, it's going to be pretty interesting. These guys are basically going to be what the meta is, like, defined around, and one or the other is going to be on your team every single time. So we have to make a difficult decision. Miraidon or Coridon? We're going to be team building around this. So, yeah, Runus are not banned. Uh, let me take a look at this. So, Coridon and Miradon basically have, like, mirrored stats. I think that Coridon could pop off. Let me think. Let me also go full screen. Okay, there we go. In the chat, it's not showing up. Hold up. There we go. All right. So, one of these has to pop off, right? I think Miradon's going to be the more common of the two. And Coridon's... Probably going to be stronger, let me think. He gets Trailblaze, right? No, no Trailblaze, no Flame Charge. He gets Flame Charge, all right. Can Miradon boost its speed at all? I think not. I think not. Honestly, I think the play for these guys is just going to be to Choice Specs them. Here's what I think I'm going to do. I think I'm going to go with Miradon, right? And I want to do this. Let's do choice specs. You get Trick Room? He doesn't get Trick Room. Okay, I was going to say, like, if he gets Trick Room, I might consider that. Terra Electric, probably. I, I think Defensive Terra might be better. Terra Flying actually does pretty well. Terra Fairy as well. Actually, let's do Terra Fairy. Terra Fairy lets me beat Opposing me right on. We'll do Draco Meteor. Dazzling Gleam. Electro Drift and I'm think yeah I'm thinking I am gonna do Booster Moth yeah there's actually no need to do Booster Energy if we really think about it I can do Volt Switch is there any other coverage move I really need I have Dragon Electric Fairy let's just do Volt Switch it seems like really strong timid yeah. This mod's going to be uber cracked. We're going to do um, Iron Moth. Yeah. Acid Spray. I want to run a Timid Nature. Max Speed. Enough special attack where I'm not like dropping. Or where I'm not like, you know, not getting anything. But also I still get my speed boost. Uh, we're actually going to do Covert Cloak. Because I'm concerned with Fake Out, and I think that they're mostly concerned with Iron Moth here. And I'm also always going to get my uh, my Quark Drive. Terra Grass. Uh, Giga Drain. Not Giga Drain. Energy Ball. Heat Wave. Protect. Paldean Prologue. Yes. The Paldean Prologue. Did I misspell it in the title? No. Alright. So. What else? Also, there's a tournament. Do I interrupt this to play in a tournament? I don't think I do. No, all right. Let's see. So, Mirren on Iron Moth. I would like a Tailwind Setter. I think I'm going to go with um, Talonflame. Oh, but do I want Cloak on Talonflame then? Maybe I want Cloak on Talonflame. Because I really think that uh, Great Tusk is going to be absolutely cracked here. Let's do Sash Great Tusk for sure. And I think I am going to put a Talonflame on the team. But we'll just do like Terra Ghost Sharp Peak. No bulk Talonflame. Just straight up like I'm going to hit you very hard. Will-O-Wisp. Uh, Tailwind. Terra Ghost? 
for NAIC slash Worlds, what do you think will be the format? Um, I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure it's just going to be like... Honestly, I kind of think we're going to be playing Series 3. Or not Series 3, but like some slightly updated version of what we're going to be playing in March. Because it's, it's going to be format... D is technically the word they're going to use because it's series three is format C. They changed the, the name for it, but it's like the same thing. Uh, so if we're assuming that, then it should be the next format after the one that we're going to play next month uh, gets announced. Like that's going to be the one that we're playing for worlds. Is it open sheet? Is what open sheet? The Paldean prologue? It, it can't be open sheet because it's online. Regulation, yeah, Regulation D. Are the box legends legal? Yes, but you only get one. All right. Um, yo, I kind of want to do Tatsugiri Dozo. You know what? I am. I'm gonna do Tatsugiri Don Dozo. Cause I actually think this just kind of like beats a lot of things. Uh, we're gonna do Terra Ground cause it doesn't lose to either form. Terra Ground. I could also do Fairy. I could do Terra Fairy Dondozo, and that like beats both of them. Absolutely. But I think Ground's gonna be more reliable for like Earthquake spam. Let me think. Um, Close Combat Hello Rush, Earthquake. I can also do Terra Flying, but that like loses to a lot of things. All right, for sure, I think we run Substitute, Leftovers. We don't have Leftovers anywhere on the team, uh, unaware. Substitute, Order Up is gonna be like essential. Do I do Earthquake? I kinda wanna do Earthquake. Yeah. Order Up, Earthquake. Wave Crash seems extremely unnecessary for this, to be honest. I think Wave Crash is kind of bad, actually. Fairy seems better. Yeah, let's do Fairy. I'll do Substitute Protect. Earthquake Order Up, yeah. I'm not even going to think about these spreads. I'm just going to make sure I'm, I'm hitting things, bro. Is Corridon also... 135 speed? It is. I didn't realize they were that fast. Alright. I'm not thinking about this. No. No way. No how. Um, seems good. Seems good. I think I keep the cloak on you and we'll just do scarf. Draco Meteor. Soak. Um... Oh, that goes crazy. Wait, that goes crazy. I just had a, a moment of brilliance there. Oh my god, hold on. What was that? I was getting so many notifications for no reason. Alright. You're thinking of singles. BGC is double. Sorry, I'm replying to a comment trying to convince me that hazards have been good in VGC forever. And I'm like, no, dog, shut up. Um, okay. Mirror V, thanks for the resub. What's good? The one and only Don Ductor also prepping for the Paldea Prologue. Uh, I got a sick Mirite on team with Terra Fire Overheat to deal with Corridon's Dragon Move, other pesky Terra Steals. Or other pesky steals and grounds that will be in my way. Nice. All right. Yeah, I think I just do this. Soak, Draco Meteor, Icy Wind. Sleep talk, baby. Nothing's going to be sleeping on this team because we have this. Actually, do I even run sleep talk? No, I need muddy water. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Look, I don't, I don't like dislike it when people don't know a lot about the game, because I think that's normal. When you're learning about Pokemon, it's normal to need to learn a, a lot of things, right? 
it's normal to like just not know certain things because you're learning the game i uh, it's annoying when you insist you're right that's my job i'm supposed to insist i'm right and be wrong okay i think this goes crazy i think this goes crazy let's hit the ladder let me also adjust my name because my name should have a space in it there we go double check everything yeah seems about right am i gale wings let me make sure i'm gale wings i feel like i forgot oh hold on I, immediately we faced this i knew we were gonna face a jump bluff today something in my brain just said yeah you're gonna face a jump bluff bro um which miradon just absolutely like annihilates let's do the honestly i really like the uh talent flame miradon lead Iron Moth Miradon's also super good into this. Let's do Moth Miradon. Moth Miradon, uh, Sash Great Tusk looks good. Or maybe, nah, let's just do Tatsugiri Dozo. Let's just, let's just Don Duct immediately. How do you manage to get Terra Shards consistently so you can build these teams? This is Showdown, my friend. I usually just ask the community for shards, though, not gonna lie. Um, I can annihilate this Great Tusk and ruin this dude's whole day. I can ruin Bro's whole day. Actually, I should just beat this with, like, Heat Wave. Wait. Do I Terra Fairy here? I think I have to Terra Fairy. Nice. Okay, we got rid of Great Tusk. When he does this online, I, I literally just ask the community for help. They're just always super helpful about it. Um, I feel in my heart of hearts that this Iron Bundle is 100% Focus Sash, so let's just get rid of it. Not really concerned about Fluttermane damage output here. Since I outspeed it with Iron Moth next turn. Are you just playing Ubers just because? No, this is the Paldean Prologue. This is a tournament that's coming up. And the tournament allows you to run one Miraidon or Coridon. All right, that's fine. Should still be doing a ton. Mystical Fire, hello? That's kind of crazy. That's kind of crazy, not gonna lie. Um, Let's just go Don Dozo and protect. I don't think I ever lose my Pokemon here. And all I really need to do is secure one more KO to win, I think. And it, it kind of has to be Bundle. If I KO Bundle, I'm like gaming. Please don't let Iron Leaves or Walking Wake be in it. Why not? They seem fine. Also, they're not. But Miraidon is legal, dude. Dane Raptor King, how you doing? There he is! There's Jumpluff! Um, is there a reason to switch? I think there is. And I think it's just I like Substitute here. I mean, I never go to sleep. I just Earthquake and get in Tatsu. I know that, like, Earthquake doesn't sound like a good idea, but trust me, it is. They didn't give this guy Pollen Puff, right? That's a concern of mine. Alright, he can't sleep me. As I stated, he can't sleep me, so I just have to land a single Earthquake. And then he ends up losing as soon as I get rid of Jump Luff. Is Hisuian Zorak legal? No, it's only Paldea Pokemon. So, like, you can't use Charizard or the other dude. Alright. They did give it Pollen Puff. That's crazy. Anyways, um, unalive. 
<laughs> Unalive. Uh, let me go for a Protect Tear Stall to turn a Tailwind, and they're going to forfeit. Nice. Nice. Let me go get my Don Ductor's hat. I'll be right back. Hold up. Okay, I'm back, and I have this. Hoggers. Okay. Let's keep going. Ooh, ooh, okay. A little bit of, little bit of hyper offense. Um, I believe. I believe in this lead like no one has ever believed in a lead in their life. You'll understand why I believe in this lead in just a moment. This is it. This is the one. Thanos chicken, your days are up. Oh yeah. I knew believing in this lead would just grant me built different status. Um, check this out. Brave Bird? Brave Bird? Icy win. This is my play. No, I muddy water. All right, win the speed tie, Town Flame. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah. Get rid of it. I missed the town. <laughs> what did I miss? <laughs> Why? I. That's all I needed. That was it. That was the whole thing. That was all I needed to win. <laughs> I was willing to sack that thing for this, dude. All right. Uh, let's uh, let's tailwind ourselves. Terra Fairy does and gleam. All right, cool. I should KO this Garchomp with a single target hit. He rock slide at me. Don't you dare flinch me. All right. We're choice specs. They don't really have anything that beats this on their team unless they have like this dude. They did bring Amoongus, but I don't think Amoongus can save it here. So I'm going to substitute in Dazzling Gleam and hope that their Terra is something stupid like Fairy. Blair Blitz. Oh my god. You know, had I gotten my tailwind off, this wouldn't be an issue. All right, um, I can win this. He's got Dragon Claw. I have to stall out Sun. Actually, I think if I stall out Sun, I just straight up win. He's not choice banded and he's going for spores here. All right, let's go for one more substitute. Thank you for just being the fattest dude ever, Dondozo. You're so cracked. You're so cracked, bro. Amoongus also has no recovery, so I just spam this. Yeah, I'll eventually KO the Amoongus. Um, I'm not sure if Dragon Claw will break my sub. It does, but I think I ultimately win by playing the long game. I just have to deal with Amoongus, really. I don't even think he's going to go for... Do I even substitute here? No, I lose. <laughs> I lose, GG. Ah, that was a really unfortunate opening. All I had to do was land that Muddy Wonder. I think we were in it. That's why you gotta run Tailwind Corv. I have Tailwind Talonflame. I would have won if I just didn't miss my move. Alright, um... Versus this. Sash Tusk doesn't look like the worst thing ever. It's just like not reliable. Maybe this team needs some kind of priority move. 
so my talent flame always outspeeds the always uh, the opposing talent flame and i don't have to i don't have to like do speed tie stuff um Ah, uh, Great Tusk isn't that good. Let's just do this again. I think this will be fine. Yeah, let's just Terra Fairy, Dazzling Gleam, Tailwind. They can't put me to... I don't even think it gets Sleep Powder, bro. And they gotta be Terra Fire to, like, not drop to this. Do you think Iron Valiant is usable in Regulation C? I mean, the same as it's ever been, you know? It's it's just, it's fine. Cool. Hoggers. It's still like a mid-tier. All right. This thing's so crazy. It just gets like a life orb boost. Is it only special attack? Hold on. Yeah, it's a special attack. I was going to say, like, can you run, like, a physical set? Um, This dude doesn't know what ladder he's on. Bro does not know what ladder he's on. Uh, also, I, in DD Armory, uh, somehow I can't escape it. Somehow, no matter what I do, I can't escape it. Have you seen any of the leaked Pokemon returning? Uh, yeah, I've seen a few. I'm not really excited about any of them. They're like just, I don't know. I'm sort of just like honed in on what we're playing right now, you know? So I'm not really looking at the future too much. Mostly looking at the past. Yeah, I think this dude just doesn't know what ladder he's on. <laughs> Granted, in DD Armor te technically, like, because there's no open team sheet here, because there's no option for it, it doesn't actually lose to any lead in particular. It just kind of, like, exists. Um... I don't think I Terra here. I think I just Acid Spray Volt Switch. Oh, wait, I never got my boost. Wait, that's kind of bad. Wait, that's kind of like really bad. Uh, Don Dozo, you can eat a hit, right? Jeez, okay. I didn't realize I never got my boost, which was really stupid of me. I'm actually gonna... Look, it doesn't matter what ladder I'm on, I'm always gonna lose to Ndidi Armourouche. It's like my kryptonite. All right, that's fine. Technically, this isn't the worst play ever. Is my play just Terra Water? I think my play is just Terra Water and like spam Dazzling Gleam for like spread damage. I think I just go for spread moves. I could also just go for Th uh, Electro Drifts. Um, cool, they both live. I get a single target. This shouldn't live. It does live, though. Incredible. There's Ungabungus. I'm always going to lose to Ndidi Armors. It doesn't matter what format, bro. Is this mono ice? Okay. Um, 
This guy is like, I, I don't, I technically like don't lose to anything here with Terra Fairy. I think I just literally repeat. I'm gonna Terra and just go for the KO on Obama Snow. I don't see a need to, I don't see a need to Tailwind here. Actually, yeah, there kind of is a need to Tailwind. Let's just do it. I could also taunt Obama Snow, and that's like just as valuable. Because it's gonna live. Is he gonna Terror Blast my, my Town Flame here? They. What? Alright, well, they got me. Um, Hopefully, I can wake up. Let's get rid of him. Miradon, can you like wake up, bro? Or like thaw or something? If they don't have freeze dry down, Dozo can just like win this in the end. So I just I just do this. Can you like thaw? Because that freeze really sucked. Oh, that freeze is the worst. Okay. Let's get in Dozo. Uh, I'm going to go for Earthquakes. Actually, is my play going to be to order up Chen Pao? I think so. I think I need that attack boost. Sacred Sword, probably. I cannot express how much I wish we still had the bug that made that like a busted move. How's Mirrodon so far? Not bad. I have been getting some pretty weird luck. I thought, it, 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 bro doesn't have the move. If I get frozen, I'm gonna be real upset. Icy Wind? Uh, that's an interesting response to the situation you're in. Um, were they freaking... Oh my god. They were, um, they were Icy Rock. The Titan. My play here is going to be to order up the Titan since they're just sucker punching for some reason. Because uh, I don't want them to belly drum up on me. And if they do belly drum up on me, I, I like ignore it, right? But like, it's still like annoying. So I'm just going to order up and get an attack boost. I'm not really scared of Chen Pao or anything really. Like if I get this off, I just like go for EQs for the rest of the game and win. Yeah, now I spam EQ. Because their snow runs out this turn and their veil runs out the next turn. That bug was awful though. It had little counterplay. I mean, true, but it wasn't like it like really broke Don Dozo. Don Dozo still wasn't consistently winning tournaments. It was just like a reliable team in general. All right. I'm trying to think if there's a way I can like beat opposing Talon Flame Tailwind more consistently, but I'm not sure. Yeah, even with the bug, people were like, oh, I don't feel like using uh order up at all okay uh they have like oh my god their whole team just drops to specs me right on the whole team really i can bring tusk in the back too tusk goes crazy eh, i think bozo is still like the optimal play it's gonna be really rare that i bring tusk it's just like an option in case it happens to be a good matchup i could hypothetically switch out tusk for something that like is better for beating opposing town flame but i'm not sure Okay, cool. Um, I don't think there's any situation where they don't like drop to this. Even with the special attack drop, I'm not sure I particularly care. It's 
crazy that Talonflame's slower than this dude. He has to be like AV. Maybe I drop Great Tusk. Maybe I do. Maybe I put like a, one of the Ruinous Pokemon on there. Yeah, it still drops. <laughs> Rock Slide. Nice miss, bro. I think I might drop Tusk. I think a Ruinous Mon might be better. I haven't brought it to anything. Let's take a look. Um... Ting Lu for Great Tusk. We don't have a grass type. <laughs> we could do uh, the other guy. I'm considering Wo Chien because it does so good into Dondozo, but it'd be another Terra Fairy Mon. You know what? Let's do Wo Chen. If if you guys really want Wo Chen, let's do Wo Chen. All right, let's do it. Oh wait, I have leftovers on them. Let me swap the item. Um. I think I just do citrus. Yeah. Okay. So this guy's got like Pachirisu plus a whole bunch of like fast boy spam. Uh, that being said, Iron Moth is just invaluable this game with Covert Cloak. So I'm just going to lead off with it. I, I don't even think I need like speed control. Uh, in the back here, they have a couple of, like, strong physical attackers, but I'm not, like, super concerned with it. I think I just go... You know, I'm gonna keep it real with you. After this, we are gonna switch back to Ting Lu. I think Ting Lu is actually the right call. Dazzle Gleam. Uh, and we'll go for Acid Spray. I think Ting Lu's gonna be better because I because I, then I can just run like AV on it and like it does good into opposing me right on in case I, I need it for that matchup. Terra Fairy, hello. Yo, yo, now this thing's gone. This thing's gone. If I outspeed, he discharged. Don't. Okay, I was gonna say if he actually like if he actually managed to do that, I would have been real upset. Um, I get Indozo here. There's the burb. I'm going to get in Geary and go for EQ. I outspeed Pachirisu. Goes for a helping hand. I can take it. Oh, he Icy Winded? Hello? Okay. I'll take it. Uh, I think that's game. Let me uh, protect for a little bit of recovery here. It's not a lot, right? But it, it will matter. What EQ. Watch me policy. That'd be crazy. Are you kidding me, dude? You're kidding me. How many times am I getting it frozen today? Okay, good news is, is I'm specs on my Tatsugiri. But now they have a speed... Or I'm, I'm like Scar for my Tatsugiri, but now they have a speed boost. That's so annoying, dude. That's like the second time I got frozen to lose a match. Yeah, EQ. Oh, that's so annoying. Hold on, let me, uh, let me switch to AV Tinglu. Fissure, Throat Chop. Um, I'm actually going to go Rock Tomb, I think. Rock Tomb and... Stomping Tantrum. Oh, 31. Yeah, no need for Heavy Slam this format.
Okay. Um, I actually really like Ting Lu in this game. Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll, we'll do Ting Lu and Mirad on lead. Actually, nah. I just go Talonflame Mirad on, and we'll do Dozo Giri in the back again. No Ting Lu needed here. Why do you want no speed on Ting Lu? Trick Room matchups. It's not like I need the speed, you know? I'm not outspeeding anything anyways. I just want to make sure I don't, like, lose in Trick Room matchups. Alright, uh, under Tailwind, I outspeed both of these guys. And I'm not particularly concerned with Mirad on getting one shot here. Let's just go for it. Does so much damage. Rock Tomb on the Talon Flame. I don't really care. Cool. Uh, let's get in Tatsugiri, and if it misses a single attack, I'm going to release it. Don't you dare miss this, dude. We, we need this to land. Doesn't Tinglu weaken your, your Mirad on? Oh, I guess that's true. That is true. But it still is like a really funny Pokemon, so I'm going to do it anyways. Okay. They're Electric Seed, but I don't care. Actually, I think my play is technically go Dozo here. So I can switch my Tatsugiri's move and Dazzling Gleam. They haven't used their Terra yet. Terra Fairy, okay. Cool, I'm going to get decent damage here. And I still have a turn of Tailwind, so let's go for a Substitute. Actually, I think I'm just gonna... Mm, I can't order up, I, I, do have, I do have to Substitute. Alright, Dozo, eat the hit. I can still sub, that's good. Leech Seed me. Yes! <laughs> that should be game. Uh, I just Protect here. All right. Yeah, he protected. He was trying to hit me through the sub. Uh, let me click Earthquake here. Should KO me right on. Um, I don't. I don't actually think that the Snarl will KO me. And then Tatsugiri can just Draco Meteor the Wochian. Oh, he tried to Leech Seed. Cool. Order up. Order up, Stinky. Order up, Stinky. Alright, we see another Dozo Giri player, but I think my team just does so much better into theirs. Especially with Tailwind here. Maybe I do actually go to Wo Chien. I think I will go Wo Chien. Let's do it. Wochan was probably the right call. Because it's I have like almost no physical attackers on this. Alright, um... Do I go for the speed tie? Kind of want to go for the speed tie, but I'm terrified of it. Terra Fire, that's fine. As long as I KO Brute Bonnet here. Went for that, hello? Oh, I'm glad I have a Dozo in the back. Alright, what's coming out? Please be Fluttermane, I think I can one-shot it. It's Don Dozo, let's burn him and go into our own Dozo. Oh, yeah, yeah, we'll burn it here. Because Lakey and Miradon looks better and better. That did, like, almost nothing. He did burn me, though, which kind of sucks. Uh, let's just go for EQ. 
And I'm going to Brave Bird the Tatsugiri. I don't actually care if they go into their Dozo. I just want to make sure this drops. Or maybe I do just Brave Bird Mirai on here. Eh, that's Brave Bird the Giri. Yeah, let's get rid of it. No Dozo for you, Bozo. Let's get in Mirai on. Tatsugiri should hypothetically win in late game. Go for the Electro Drift into them. As well as a Taunt on the Dozo. That one shot's nice. Cool. Electro Drift. Hoggers. You couldn't rest anyways. Electro Train was up, bro. <laughs> Yeah, the showdown animation kind of goes hard. Uh, Mirrodon still goes crazy here. I have to be careful, though. Like in Terra Fairy Dozo also, like, is ridiculous. Do they have any actual speed control? Not really, if you don't count the bundle. Let's do Moth, Mirrodon, Dozo Giri again. I think that's going to be our main mode. I think this is a four Pokemon team, bro. It's gonna be real rare we bring Wo Chen. All right, I'm really glad I went with this lead because I think they're always going to fake out Iron Moth. I, I think that they're just always going to do that. Does Iron Moth get any speed control? Does it get like Rock Tomb or something stupid? Let's go! Cloak time. <laughs> Cloak time. Goodbye. Iron Jugulus? Bro, I don't even care. I don't even care. That should be faster, right? Yeah. Nah, nothing. Nice. Uh, this is another team that just gets cooked if I play this right. Wo Chen, ironically, not bad here. Actually, pretty decent. But Moth lead is also, like, ridiculous. Let's just do that. Um, I think Wo Chen endgame is possibly something that we can do. Wo Chen... No Talonflame here. Let's do Wochen Tatsugiri. Um, I'm satisfied with my purchase. Let's uh, get rid of the Sash on you. And just Deagle him. Oh, they actually faked out the right one. Well, I suppose the good news is um, I don't care and I shouldn't lose my Miraidon. So I can always do this. They also have to land a Hydro Pump for this like turn to pay off. Cool. Get rid of the fast mon. Uh, let's get in our. I think now's the Wo Chen moment, honestly. Tatsu's also not bad because I could just Draco theirs. Let's do Tatsugiri and then a reactive Wo Chen. Yeah. 
I could Icy Wind and go crazy. But I don't think that's... I think they're going to Terra Fairy 2 is the, the issue, right? I'm going to Icy Wind. And go into Wochian. Cool. I'm always going to be faster than this thing now. Electro Drift should do, like, almost nothing. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's the good stuff, dude. That was legit, Nash. Um, hit that Iron Hands with this fat Leech Seed. Or actually, a knockoff's better. A knockoff's going to go so much further for me. That was legit, Nash. <laughs> and that late game, that late game Dazzling Gleam is going to carry me. Just want to get rid of the lefties on this guy first. All right. Take bets. What's the Terra type? It comes down to the Terra type. I have to always Dazzling Gleam here. I'm not going to lie. But if they just like are a bad Terra, I win. Because <laughs> I always KO right on. They don't have anything that outspeeds me in the back. Fairy. I'm pretty sure it's going to be Fire and I lose, to be honest. But this is my only out. Meowskarada? Yo? 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 This should still do a ton. And if they're like not smart, they'll go into their own Mirad on here. Basically, if, look, yeah. Oh, Terra Grass, hello? Why'd you do that? Did they drain punch me? I don't know why they would drain punch there. Okay, good game. Dang, I thought I had that one. Can you try Koride on? I don't feel like losing that much. All right. Um, right. Let's see. I think that the Moth lead actually goes crazy. I just have to hope that they fake out the right one. Is it that bad? Bro, like, Koride on doesn't do anything. It has one set. It's Terra Fire Flare Blitz, and, like, even then you're not doing much. Um, in the back here. Do, 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 do. do I want late game Tailwind? I, I'm kind of concerned about um, this guy. So let's do this again. Kind of concerned about Trick Room stuff. What about Sun Teams? What about Sun Teams? <laughs> like, all right. So here's the reason Sun Teams aren't going to work out too well. Uh, we have Electric Terrain, and Sun Teams are hard carried by Chlorophyll Sleep Powder shenanigans. With Electric Terrain always on the field, nothing's ever going to go to sleep. And Sun Teams just, like, lose to stuff that's going to, like, just exist. Like, Don Dozo is going to be one of the biggest Pokemon in this tournament. Uh, let's see. You know what? Let's just go for it. Okay, they're going to Tailwind? They're Snarling, all right. That did so much. Let me Heat Wave you. Okay, cool. I don't know why they're not max speed on this thing. They should be max speed. And I don't think they beat this anymore. Iron Bungle. Uh, Iron Bungle could turn it around. But I, all I really have to do is just target it down here. Yeah, they're going to lose one of these Pokemon. I don't know which one. It's going to be Bungle. Yeah, uh, I win if I stall out the last couple of turns of this. Let's go for... I just have to knock out Bungle. Let's just pre Actually, I just double attack here, don't I? Because I need to KO Bungle. They protected. No! 
I can still win if I just KO Bundle. I could do something crazy and protect and go for an attack, but I don't feel like making a read when it can lose me the game just as easily. Okay, I'm glad I did what I did. Because that bounces off of me. Yay! Protect here, and then I like a leech seed to win. Draco Meteor? I like live that, don't I? Yeah, I love that. Cool. Uh, if I land this Leech Seed, I'm guaranteed to win. I missed the Leech Seed. Not great. Let's protect for some leftovers. They have to crit that to win. Cool. Land the Leech Seed. Thank you. All right, cool. <laughs> I was going to say, like, if I miss another Leech Seed, that, like, we're having some bad, bad luck tonight, then. Yeah, I forgot. Look, I'm so used to leftovers on this guy that I just forgot. Uh, we faced this dude before, and he just, like, lost to this. I suppose he does have a lot of physical attackers. I could actually go Wo Chen again. Wo Chen in the back isn't bad, it's just like not great. Let's do Dozo Giri, yeah. Silly goose. All right. Um, vote now in chat. Vote now in chat. Do I do I just like win the speed tie? Because I kind of want to just go for the speed tie win. Let's just go for the speed tie win. Da -da -da -da. No tailwind for you. Win the speed tie. Win the speed tie. Oh, he's going to get tailwind, isn't he? No, I'm good. No tailwind for you. Only tailwind for me. <laughs> Thank you. And honestly, depending on what's in the back, I might just win by going into Dozo right now. Leafeon? Uh, mm, debatable. Uh, let's just Dazzling Gleam and like KO this thing and then I win with my guy. Yeah. Terra Fairy, hello? Can I outspeed? Thank you. That's all I really needed. Flare Blitz me, Breaking Swipe. That one shots. That's crazy that Breaking Swipe can do that much. Anyways. Uh, Terra Fairy, order up. To be immune to Breaking Swipe, because he should do it. I should outspeed Leafeon, I think. Maybe. Possibly. Yeah. Cool. Cool. Fluttermane, uh, let's go for a Protect here. I don't think they have setup. If they're running Protect Breaking Swipe, they certainly don't have setup. I don't know why they did that. Let's uh, Earthquake here. Don't get me wrong, Flare Blitz is going to hurt, but like it doesn't hurt that much. And their Sun is out next turn. Why are you stalling out your own son? You don't benefit from that. Oh, of course, dude. Of course. All right, I think I still win. Because for some reason, they're still breaking swiping. All right. <laughs> Uh, 
Um, let's see. No, like, great speed control. This is another game where I could perhaps win turn one with the Iron Moth version of this team. Uh, for late game, Dozogiri is still optimal. Uh, however, Wo Chen could be justified. Depends. I think Dozogiri is going to be the best, yeah. What's the ladder look like this or look like for this? Number one's 1406. Okay. We're not that high on the ladder yet. Yeah, like I said, this is another one where I could just hypothetically win turn one if they fake out the Iron Moth, which I'll be honest, I think they're going to do it. I think in this lead, you go, oh yeah, baby, Iron Moth free, and then you, like, lose the tusk. Nope, they're just going to lose the tusk voluntarily. Oh, there's Scarf, hello? Okay. Well, that's still fine. Let's get in uh, our Scarf Tatsugiri for good speed control. And if they are Terra Fire, which I, depending on what they bring out here, I might just predict Terra Fire. But if they bring out like Chen Pao, I'm actually going to Icy Wind. Fluttermane? Uh, yeah, I'm going to Icy Wind. Because I outspeed Fluttermane. Break the Sash, KO it. That's huge. Thank you. Cool. Does this KO? Probably not, but it's going to come close. Yeah. If I keep my Mirite on, by the end of this turn, I should be good. Wild Charge does a lot. Wow. Um, that speed control is really big, though, because now they lose to Earthquake. Aha, <laughs> uh -huh, Earthquake time. Thank you. Yeah, because now, now Flutterman gets outsped. That's hilarious. That's actually hilarious. Dude, Commander, Choice Scarf, Tatsugiri, that's really the play. That's seriously the play. Don't care. Lose your flutter. Send out the Coridon. I don't care. I know you brought it. I know you brought that thing. Send out the Coridon. What does he even do? Oh, it's Chin Pao, hello? Oh, that's a little concerning, but uh, two Earthquakes will do it, and two Sacred Swords shouldn't KO me. Haze. Okay, that's still concerning. I might have lost. Depending if they drain punch. Wild charge? Mm, yeah, I lost. Oh, <laughs> why do they have haze? That's not even like a... You should run Sacred Sword. You should run Sacred Sword. My friend. Okay. It is what it is. Okay, see, this is what I'm talking about. Um, this is like a sun team, right? But also, Lilligan's carried by the fact that it can go for, like, sleep powders, and it just doesn't get to do that. Uh, Wo Chen is an option here. I actually think that I just, like, do this. Yeah, I keep going Dozogiri. Dozogiri is, like, really reliable here. Um... Unfortunately, the reason I have to do this is to get a KO turn one, which doesn't seem likely. Because if they end up going with this, if they end up going the trick room mode, it could like lose me the game. So I'm I have to like predict trick room every time. Uh, no, I'm fine. I just have to win a speed tie, unfortunately. Okay. 
Go for Iron Head. Hello? That's a crazy prediction. Let's go Dozo here. I can just start Earthquaking, and I actually don't think they beat that. Late Game Moth could be useful. Oh, I could have subbed. You know, actually, no. With this team in particular, I kind of understand the thought process because if you look at it, they have a way to remove Sun entirely. I always protect here. So Lilligant does make sense for this. Sleep Powder. All right. Uh, unfortunately, I'm forced to just dodge. I'm forced to go for the dodge. Oh, okay. Well, I'm not sure what that really accomplishes because I think I just pp stall this. And you eventually have to go for something that's like not Encore. Yeah, like Leaf Storm. Which you're going to run out of pp for eventually. All right, cool. Um, I'm no longer on cord, so I'm just going to go for order ups into the Lilligant. Because I need to KO it. All right. Nah, I technically earth. Nah, I do, I do order up the Lilligant here. Cool. Uh, Iron Moth comes out. I gotta start clicking Heat Waves and Icy Winds. And just hope that I can dodge another Sleep Powder. Yeah, I like the thought process here. I was trashing on Sun Teams not too long ago. But like within DD, it does make sense. It gets rid of like the biggest issue. I'm um, not sure what they were thinking there, because if I don't miss this heat wave, I just like am in a good spot. Yeah, they can't sucker punch me. Yeah. I lose to Core right on here. Crit? Question mark? Yeah, that's game. All right. Uh, Acid Spray, technically my strongest move. No, it's still Heat Wave. <laughs> All right, GG. Let's do one more. One more. I'll be honest. I, I, I like, we're losing a little bit right now, but I think that it's just like not actually an issue with the team. I think I'm just not playing that great at the end of this. Uh, as far as like the actual like tournament, I think we're fine. I think this will work just fine since it's a best of one ladder tournament. Uh, for this one, didn't we face this guy already? Let's do old reliable. I do like Wochen Endgame a little bit. And Dozo Giri is also not bad. Um, let's go Dozo Giri. It's reliable. When is the tourney? I think it's March 10th. So like in a week. I have to look into it. Let me see. Actually, it's right here. Uh, March, yeah, it's gonna be, it starts on March 10th until the 12th, yeah. Yeah, Moongus with Miradon doesn't make too much sense. Unless they're using it exclusively for redirection. I actually think Amoongus isn't gonna be that good in this tournament just because of how good, like, how there's always gonna be electric terrain. Yeah, you have a while to practice the team. That's what I'm thinking, like, I'll be fine. Um... Let's just It's most likely Sash. I could Terra here. Like live a hydro pump. 
I'm gonna Terra here on Hydro Pump and just go for the Deagling. They're doing it, yeah. Icy Wind, ah, that's fine. I still get rid of like the most threatening Pokemon. I was only really scared of that. Um, and I still get to have a lot of pressure here with uh, Acid Spray stuff. Iron Hands, yeah, uh, I'll just Acid Spray. And... I think I'd go Dozo. Dozo's more likely to live this. Dozo does not live, but now I get in the Muride on. And Acid Spray into Specs Deagleam, I think should do it, but it's gonna be really close. I could also just like Heat Wave Deagleam and that might do it. That might be safer actually. Yeah, because I KO Iron Hands, and now Miradon doesn't feel too comfortable. Yeah, with like Tatsugiri in the back now, I can just like Icy Wind. Um, yeah, unless it's like Scarf Great Tusk, I think I always win if I just connect a single Icy Wind here. Cool, connect on the Great Tusk. That's game. GG. Even though I missed my Icy Wind. <laughs> Wait, did I miss another one? <laughs> Bro. All right. Yeah, we had some interesting luck today. It is what it is. Um, but yeah, I'll be right back. We'll do a couple of uh, Series 3 games with this team that I've been messing around with uh, when I come back. But I'm going to go ahead, run to the bathroom, take my pre-workout, uh, and we'll, we'll start back up in just a second. If you're watching on YouTube, though, you know, if you enjoyed the testing session for this upcoming tournament, Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.